quite interesting. Yeah. So, twilight. That's that nasty military installation out there. Slangly, schlangly, shitly. I don't know what they call it. So, uh, yeah, I'm up here. We got her up. We got her cleaned. We got the bottom of her clean, as you can see. Yeah. We got her slung up over the cabin. Got some power and some more lights up here. Grandma got all her lights up tonight. Yeah, isn't that amazing? Sitting out here working on the water at this time of night. Oh, better be focused here. Yeah. Puppy dog sleeping. Booger sleeping. We got a park light up here. Everything's so good so far. We've got a lot of stuff right here. But we got our area clean. Crank the wind up a slang over there. They got that vortex generator. They play with it over there. They claim it's a, a NASA test pad, but we've seen some other things go on with that thing. From a science mind of view. Anyways, we size of my hand. If I remember to get it when I go back, it doesn't even matter. So yeah, we got it cleaned up. I'm gonna put that seat mount out of there. I do some transom modification. Yeah, I tend to say this is probably catching, forcing some water up here. So this all has to be raised to here. We found out this block only had one screw. So this whole block fell down. It won't fall down now, it's probably dried in with wood, but anyways, this thing had dropped off all the way down to here. So yeah, this has to be raised all the way up to here. And these 2x4 can get cut out of here, I already cut it out once, but... And then the transom will come up here to see we'll raise. This will be almost, it's an inch, we change everything by an inch at the end. That's why we got an inch gap there, that's why we got an inch gap here. And I put a 2x4 on because I was worried it would twist. The angles, the angles could change on it, but uh, yeah, we got one little leak here, I guess. Water dripping off this pod somewhere. There's a leak in here, a little pinhole. This tank, that's where it's all full of water. Yeah, it came out pretty good. And you see that? That's light coming through the fiberglass from upstairs. Kind of interesting looking, huh? Yeah, a patch job. Some uh, guy uh, we call Safety Steve uh, put this boat upside down on his truck hauling it for Bonnie a couple of years ago and uh, cinched it down with some 10,000 pound straps just being sure it was extra safe and cracked the freaking hole. Yeah, the guy isn't the brightest bulb on the tree. <clears throat> but anyway, so we already patched that earlier this spring. So now we have to take out these bolts. Put new bolts in. I gotta close the hatch so I have a place to walk in. It's my deck. It's half a deck. But yeah, I gotta pull these big bolts and washers out. Three quarter inch bolts. They go through into the transom. I got a little flashlight for working in the pods. But it's nice out here. Nice sea breeze. I don't know how much of this you can actually hear. Maybe you can, maybe you can. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. This is what I'll be doing. I thought I'd get done with the barnacles by sunset, but it was quite a mess. The work didn't take any much longer than I thought, but the cleanup took quite a mess. Uh, I filled the vacuum shot back completely uh, with barnacles. It's about 30 pounds. Pretty crazy. All right, wishing you all a good evening. And Zena says good night too, and from Boogie as well. What do you say good night? Say good night. Tell him. What do you say? Say good night. Okay. Tell him. All right. Oh, she's gonna tell him. All right. Hey, hey, Zena. Where's the boat? See the boat? Where's the boat? 
Hey, where's Bob? Where's Bob? Right there. Where's Bob? Let's see him. Where is he? Let's see him. You better go look. You better look for that Bob. He's always looking for Bob. Like watching that guy on duty. I don't know if it's going to let us have this video. We might have to remake it because they. It's a nice play game, so we have too much fun.